Thank you very much. Take care. My name is Seiya Watanabe, a 25 year old working at a bakery. Our shop has been passed down through generations and is reasonably popular locally. You'll handle the rest of the shop. I'm working on the preparations. Got it, Dad. Even though this time is usually slow. Maybe I'll clean the front or something. Hmm? Is that? <laughs> she's not someone I recognize. From the looks of it, she's still in elementary school. I wonder what's going on. Instead of just standing there, why not come inside? <gasps> what kind of bread do you like? All of ours are delicious. Um, I... I want the crust of the bread. Huh? The crust? But I don't have money, so is this okay? She must have some circumstances. In that case, wait a moment, okay? Take as much as you want. Here, this one. I don't have money, so only this. At this rate, it might not sell anyway. Here, as a thank you for the lovely marbled glass bead. Th thank you very much. Since then, in the evening, the girl often comes to our place. Welcome. What would it be today? Melon bread and something with cream inside, please. Okay, I'll prepare it right away, so please wait. Her name seems to be Alisa. I still don't know much besides her name. I tried asking a few times about other things, but she seems incredibly hesitant to answer. Delicious! I really love your bread. <laughs> Thanks. Hey, I'm the one who bakes. Whenever you're hungry, come on over. Both Dad and I are looking forward to seeing you. Y yes Thank you very much. I'll definitely come again. However, one day, Alisa stopped coming altogether. I wonder what happened to that girl. I don't know. I hope she's doing well. Despite being curious about her for a long time, time continued to pass. Ten years have passed. Taking over as the shop owner after my father retired due to health issues, I find myself in charge now. Ah, it's so slow. At this rate, we are practically in a state of temporary closure. And it's all because... Come on, come on! The trendy, luxury loaf of bread is here! It's incredibly delicious, so be sure to try one. Eh, <sighs> as popular as ever. Recently, a new bakery has opened, right in our neighborhood. Almost like... a provocation. Thanks to that, we've lost many regular customers, and our foot traffic has decreased significantly. All the wheat used is domestically sourced. We also use carefully selected, fresh cream and butter. And these are only one dollar for a whole loaf. Such a great deal! Luxury loaf, huh? Should I try offering something similar at the same price? No, doing that would undoubtedly lead to a deficit. But if I do nothing, the shop will... Hmm? What's going on? <sighs> wow, she's incredibly beautiful! And a... a butler? I've never seen one in person before. Wait, why are they coming over here? Long time no see. Huh? Who are you? It's me, Alisa. I'm sorry for being late. I've come to repay the favor from back then. What? Afterward, they decided to move to the eat-in space of the store to continue our conversation. Um, is it really you, Alisa? Yes. Nice to see you again. I'm Alisa Takano. And this is... I am Chachamaru, entrusted with the care of the young lady. Pleased to meet you. Oh, uh, thanks for being so polite. According to the story, she is currently the president of a company called Koiwa Foods. The Koiwa Group? That's amazing. It's a huge company, isn't it? No. I'm just helping out as my father told me to. The young lady is performing her duties as the president admirably. The fact that she is beloved by the employees is proof of that. Oh, Chachamaru. <laughs> You're exaggerating. I'm still inexperienced. <laughs> 
The girl from back then is now a president. I guess I'm getting older too. It's not like that at all. Seiya, you are wonderful. Just as I imagined. Uh, uh, really? If you say that, I can't help but feel embarrassed. So, this is my feelings. I owe my current self to you. Roughly, $30,000 is enclosed. 30? I can't accept something like that. Hmm? Why not? Is this not enough? It's not that. I want to be of help to you, Seiya. I know. It must be tough managing the shop right now, right? Ah, uh, did you even investigate that far? The Takano family's butler is excellent. This much information takes no more than five minutes. Amazing! Butlers are something else. I'm truly grateful. I want to do anything for you. Are my feelings bothersome? Mm. What's this? She's incredibly cute. Besides, you know, you can never have too much money, right? Uh, certainly. Right now, I could use all the operating funds I can get. But I already received proper compensation from you. See? Oh! You still have them? Yeah, it's really beautiful. It's my treasure. Uh, I'm happy. It was a precious gift from my late grandfather, too. Such an important thing. I got it! I've come up with a good idea. Huh? For each marble, I'll grant one of your wishes. Anything you want. Wait, anything? Indeed, it's a splendid idea. <laughs> Chachamaru, you're exaggerating again. So, Seiya, please think about it, okay? I'll come back to hear it next time. No, no, that's troubling. Chachamaru, let's go. It's time for the board meeting. Understood, young lady. Wait, wait! Since then, Elisa has been dropping by our store from time to time. Um, have you decided on your wish? Hmm. Is it wealth that you desire? Or fame? No, maybe power? Hmm. It doesn't matter what it is. I'll grant any and all wishes you have. No, really. Are you a genie in the lamp? Or perhaps a dragon from a certain nationally popular manga? Well, it's something similar. Amazing! Being the president of a big company. Come on, make a wish. Anything? Really? Of course! Oh, but that doesn't mean you can ask for more wishes, okay? I wouldn't say something that cliché. Anything, huh? In that case, my wish is... Alright, how about helping out at the shop for a bit? It gets a bit busy around this time. Huh? Help out? Yeah, it would be a big help. I can't afford to hire anyone. Here, take this marble. Um, if it's okay with you... Ten minutes later. <laughs> how do you enter things on the cash register? Hey, are you okay? I'll handle the cashier. <laughs> Sorry! Another day? How about helping with baking bread today? Hmm... Another request like that? Huh? You said you'd grant any wish, right? Y yes of course I'll grant any wish. Ah! Oh, the flower exploded! What? How did it come to that? It must be a flower just explosion! If that were the case, it would be a much bigger disaster by now. Anyway, we need something to wipe with. Ah! Making bread is really tough. And another day. Hey, Alisa, I'm a bit tired. Can you give me a shoulder massage? Leave it to me. A request like that is a piece of cake for me. Oh, you seem quite relaxed today. <laughs> Just in case, I learned the massage technique from Chachamaru. However... How is it? Feels good, doesn't it? If you're sleepy, you can even go ahead and sleep. <laughs> uh, ouch! Hey, a, a bit too strong. Huh? But... Chachamaru does it with this much strength. After all that, one month later. Ugh. I 
haven't been of any help at all. No, that's not true. You've been fulfilling my wishes properly, haven't you? It's not like that. Ugh. I had planned to show you a much cooler side of me. Jeez, were you worried about that? For me, just being like this is a lot of fun. Aww, Saseya. Hmm? What's wrong? Um, my, uh, head? Hmm? Uh, oops, sorry. Uh, I got carried away like in the old days. Uh -huh. What am I doing? She's not a kid anymore. No, please keep patting me more. Uh, but... I love it when you do that so much. Oh, she's so cute. Um, well, anyway, getting help when I'm in trouble is already a huge relief for me. If something comes up again, I'll count on you, okay? Here, uh, prepaid marble. Hmm... Making such requests again? Seiya, how selfless can you be? Well, even if you say that... I really don't mind anything, you know. For example... Um... Something like... Wanting... Me? Perhaps? Hey, what are you doing? That's too close! Come on, don't you want me? If it's what you desire, I'm willing to do anything. Ugh, asking Alisa for anything, no matter what? No, but, but that's... W what Th That was just a joke. I'm leaving today, S -s see you later. Hey, Alisa? Ah, uh, she's gone. I wonder, what do I really think about her? She admires me so much. But it's probably because of things from the past. A guy like me, an old man, can't be taken seriously. After all, she's the president. There's one marble left. What should I wish for in my final request? After some time, the feared moment had come. No, the operating funds are completely insufficient. At this rate, this shop will close next month. Am I going to ruin this shop that has so many memories just because of me? Even though it's filled with precious memories. Uh, welcome. Hey there! Is this shop still running? <laughs> it's so empty. I thought it had already gone out of business. You two, from Uzachara Bakery. Oh, you knew about us! Nice to meet you. I'm Charao Yabasugi. I'm his wife, Uzami. What do you want? Well, since we're here, let's apologize properly. Huh? What do you mean? Well, sorry about that. Your shop is just losing to ours all the time. From the looks of it, yours seems about to go under, doesn't it? Don't push yourself too hard. A weak little bakery like this should close down soon for your own good. <clears throat> Frustrating, but I can't find the right words to retort. Oh, really? That's quite audacious coming from you. You two are running quite a shady business despite that. Alisa? Hey, what's with this woman? Who are you? Should we ask you to stop saying weird things? Even if you say that, it's the truth. Um, what do you mean? Seiya, you mentioned it before, right? Locally sourced wheat carefully selected cream and butter, using such expensive ingredients, there's no way you could sell it for just one dollar. That high quality bread? I did say that, but... That's why I looked into it a bit. I was suspicious too. Hey, what do you mean suspicious? Exactly! We have a special supply route. There's a reason we can sell at such low prices. Reasons, you say? Chachamaru! That one. Here it is! Falsifying the origin of ingredients, using illegal additives. This is the reason you can make it cheap. Right? Well, why are you bringing that up? In reality, the wheat is cheaply sourced from overseas. It seems you use very little cream and butter as well. What? Deceiving customers? <laughs> hey, who is this woman? Uh, she is... 
She is the representative director of Koiva Foods, Miss Alisa. What? Koiva Foods? You mean Koiva Groups? Isn't that our loan provider? I will report this matter to my father. Who is the representative of the group? What? D -d Don't mess with us. If that happens, we'll go bankrupt. Just benefiting from your parents' status. Don't act all high and mighty. <laughs> hey, cut it out with the resentment. It's pretty much your own fault. Say ya. Alisa is by no means riding on her parents' coattails. She's a hard worker, dedicated in everything she does, and an amazing woman. I won't let anyone speak ill of her. <sighs> well, why are you getting so worked up? Ha! <laughs> I'm getting all serious. Now that the discussion seems to be over... Yeah. This guy! When did he get behind us? Let's change the location and discuss things thoroughly. The crime of showing disrespect to the young lady. You'll properly atone for that, won't you? No, 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 no way. way! Well then, let's go! No! Let go! Wait, how strong is this guy? Afterward, numerous wrongdoings came to light, and Uzachara Bakery went bankrupt. Their funding was cut off, leaving behind a substantial amount of debt. On the other hand, in our shop, since then, customers have returned safely, and we somehow managed to turn a profit. All thanks to Alisa. No! It's because your bread is delicious, Seiya. By the way, why did you go to such lengths? Investigating must have been tough, right? Well, because you asked me before, right? When in trouble, help. I received the marble for that. Ah, the prepaid one. So that's why. But it's not just that. I, I like you, Seiya. So I really wanted to be of help. Oh, you like me? I'm a 35-year-old man. It doesn't matter. Seiya, you're my first love. I really didn't want to be far from you. Then, why did you suddenly disappear back then? That's... Ten years ago, her father's company was apparently on the verge of bankruptcy. They were chased by debt, and the family became poor. Consequently, they always went hungry. At that time, it was you who helped us. But then we had to suddenly move, relying on distant relatives. And in the end, I couldn't even say goodbye. So that's what happened. I've always been worried about the shop and you. But after my father's company recovered, we kept moving overseas. Then it must be difficult to come and visit. Yes. So when I returned here, I couldn't just stay still. I knew the shop was struggling. She's gone to such lengths for me. Maybe... I should be honest about my feelings too. I also like you, Alisa. If it's okay with you, I want to be with you forever. That's my final wish. <gasps> I'm so happy! Yes! I want to be together forever! And so, we began dating. Now, there are talks of collaborating with Koiwa Foods to expand our bakery nationwide. I came to visit again. Huh? Is everything okay with your duties as the president? I finished my work properly, but more importantly... When should we have our wedding? W wedding Yes, you said it, right? That you want to be together forever? That's like a proposal, isn't it? Uh, I didn't mean it that way. I'll do my best to grant your wishes. I love you. It's a bit unexpected, but with her, the future life ahead will undoubtedly be happy. Hi, it's me, Mel. Thanks for watching my channel. I'm super happy if you watch the next and other videos too.